There it is, the Tinker board from Asus. I did a little unboxing today, I picked this up from CPC this morning. Um, got a little project I'm working on. I think this might be slightly beefier than a Raspberry Pi 3. Get the job done a little bit better. So, first of all, I'm just going to do a quick unboxing just to see what you actually get. So, there we go. Here we go. What have we got in here? Oh, nice. So, it looks like it comes with a. Can you see that? Little heat sink with an adhesive pad. Um, nice instruction manual there. Very good, I'm sure I'll not read that. And here it is the Tinkerboard itself. bit sticky. Right, anyway, so focus. Yep. So I'm guessing flip it around. More RAMs, micro SD card, all this stuff I'm guessing it you know, looks like the yeah, same footprint as a Raspberry Pi three. Um some Rock chip jerky's there, Wi Fi card. Very good. It's a rock chip RK3288. No idea about that. It does seem like it's been used in a couple of the Chromebooks, so hopefully, the Linux distro doesn't suck. So, um, here we are, pretty much. That's what you get. So there's some extra headers on there, not a clue what they do yet. But yeah, if you want to put in the comments what you would like me to test on this, or I'm going to write through Pi 3, we could possibly do some back to backs on it. Um, okay, I'm going to be looking into 3D side of things, WebGL, stuff like that. Hopefully, it doesn't suck on this. We'll be back to the drawing board again. But yeah. Put some comments in the uh, below, just anything you want me to test or give it a whirl. There we are, the uh, Asus Tinkerboard.